What's up guys, my name's Kieran, aka Prophecy, call me whatever you like, but today I am back. So finally, after a long, long time of working, I've sorted out the computer. I know I keep saying this, but I keep on getting errors, but I've sorted out the computer. I've finally sorted out open broadcast software, so it's not all pixelated. I have been recording videos almost daily, right? But it's been so pixelated, so fuzzy, so furry, my voice hasn't been clear, what I've been saying doesn't make sense, I've been looking like an idiot in the videos, I look like an idiot normally but that don't matter, and the gameplays just don't seem fun or interesting or anything like that, so I don't want to ruin any credibility that I sort of have on my channel by posting up crap gameplays, so I've waited and hopefully... Hopefully, we can get a pretty good gameplay today. So, without any further hesitation, let's jump straight into a game. We're just going to play some Team Deathmatch and get used to Black Ops 3 again. Talking about just random crap as we go along. But guys, remember to like and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you in that game. Alrighty, guys, we are in. We are playing a slight bit of this fantastic map called Combine. And even though I haven't played Black Ops 3 in forever, I can still remember this map being shit. And I'm sure it's gonna, be, well not shit, but like always overplayed, over camped on as I see two people straight up. Oh, I've been tagged by them. Jesus, should have launched that grenade through. Would have been a bit safer, but look. Come on, sit down. That's it, right. We died once, that's it. We're gonna just wipe this Team Deathmatch game now. That's it, we die once, and that is all. Alright, no one's in here. I was concentrating a bit then. So, I turned on my Black Ops 3 today. It's the first day, like I said, that I've turned on Black Ops 3 in a long while, and damn it. And I think that Treyarch must have listened to us guys moaning about the goddamn supply drops, because suddenly, I get 10 supply drops, or 10 rare supply drops, and a weapon bribe, and if I win 75 games, I can get that all over again. Like, how fantastic is that? Literally, one of my biggest pet hates about Black Ops 3 was the fact about all the shitty supply drops and it, I never get no weapons. But now, if I play, I'm guaranteed to get a weapon. That's pretty damn sweet, I think. I'm going to go more into detail about that in a later video that will either be up later on today or tomorrow, whichever one I get around to. The new gun. The new gun. I've seen loads of hype about this gun. It's the FAMAS from Black Ops 2, I believe. And we picked it up. Let's see if it's any good. I used to bloody love the FAMAS on Black Ops 2. It was like my go-to gun. Always. Always the FAMAS. You know, it's that beast assault rifle which fires like a tank. Has the accuracy of a tank. Pretty much just is a tank that I can carry around within my hands. That's how I seem to re remember recalling the FAMAS anyway. Sit down, Sonny. We got two kills of it. It's pretty. That's actually pretty decent. But we'll go back to this M8A7. So yeah, I'm gonna go into detail a lot on the the whole weapon bribes thing because I can really get my head around it. But I've sort of worked it out now. So I'll go into detail about that for you guys. You fans who have been sat patiently waiting. Let's burn some people. Da boy. Ah, Sonny. I know I said when I died once that that was it. We're not going to die no more. Well, I'm sorry, guys. I sort of lied. We've died three more times, but that don't matter. For that, this is honestly my first game on Black Ops in about three weeks. Something like that. That's like how much I haven't been playing Black Ops 3. In fact, I haven't even turned on my PlayStation in three weeks. Damn it. There we go. I've literally just been like using pre-recorded videos, using videos like off of like CSGO and stuff like that to try and sort out the pixelation from my PC. And literally today I finally found the crack for it. Not like the torrent kind of crack, but like the crack on how to fix it. So it was actually a video on YouTube, so a huge shout out to that dude. Who was able to help me as we went on a slight bit of a streak there. But I finally sit down. Finally, finally got it all sorted. 
and as you guys can see, we're running it right now at 720p, 60 frames per second, baby. I wanted 1080p, but I think trying to record at 1080p was too much strain on the old computer, the old little thing. It couldn't really handle 1080p. I've had all the playback in my NVIDIA graphics card, couldn't really handle the 1080p. So I dropped it down to 720p, and from watching like reviews and stuff of like little clips that I've recorded, we have got a pretty smooth thing. It's just my accuracy's not smooth. We've got a pretty smooth recording, it's just the accuracy ain't, ain't too smooth. And it's gonna take me a couple of videos to get used to like talking to YouTube because for those of you people who don't do YouTube you probably won't understand you probably think oh talking to a camera is easy but when you're here you gotta think man you gotta make entertaining videos you gotta talk for that time as we pick up this far again you gotta play well in that time so you gotta concentrate whilst talking and people that know me you know I cannot do two things at once I, I, I just struggle to multitask whatsoever Doing two things at once is something that I am never, ever going to be good at. I'm a one-man person who can do a one-man job and do it slow. I don't do anything quick. I do everything nice and slow. Damn. Do everything nice and slow. Sit down, Sonny. I'm just going to launch a grenade through there. So talking in front of the camera, it's going to take me a few videos to get used to it, but I'll get I'll get back on track with it soon, guys, and I'll be pumping out some high-quality content and pr proving to you guys that, you know, I've got what it takes to be a, a YouTuber. Keep shooting me. Keep shooting me. Damn it. My purifier won't come out in time. I'm literally just going to go on a burn. No, I'm not. I died. Sorry, I just lied to you guys. Guys, over the next few days, you can be expecting a lot of channel revampation. I've got a, I've got a brand new logo drawn out. I've got brand new headers drawn out. Thumbnails, all stuff like that, all drawn out. Literally, everything is drawn out. I just need to somehow get it from the paper to the computer. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that yet, but what I'm going to do is we pick up this final kill right here. Look at this. Burst, missed. Hit him. Hit him. That's right. It's a four bullet burst gun, but somehow I hit a burst and one bullet him. I don't know. It worked. I'm not complaining. We get third place too. I'm happy about that, considering, you know, I haven't really played in like a whole week. We're going to cash out some money right now, guys. I'd like to thank you also very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this introduction gameplay. I promise you it's only going to get bigger and better from here on out. Like I said at the start of the video, guys, remember to like and subscribe. As always, I've been your boy Prophecy, and until the next time, I'll see you fudging later. Adios!